Breaking news fresh out of the BIS for CBDCs, a unified ledger for CBDCs tokenized assets could enhance global financial system straight from the BIS. June 20th, 2023 at 7 a.m. It is June 20th at 7.03 a.m. So let's dive into it. This would be a game changer in how we think about money and how transactions take place, said the central bank's group head of research. If we go down here, a new type of market infrastructure in the form of a unified electronic ledger could enhance the global financial system. This ledger proposed by the umbrella group of central banks as part of its annual economic report could combine central bank digital currencies along with tokenized money and assets on one platform with the help of automated smart contracts that power transactions on blockchains, including Ethereum, bringing together central bank money, commercial money, and different assets on the same platform, all tokenized and interacting, opens up a whole new range of possibilities. The current monetary system is not seamless because databases must be connected by third-party messaging systems such as SWIFT that send messages back and forth with participants having incomplete views of actions, the report said. A new unified ledger would eliminate delays and uncertainty. The envisioned financial system would, according to the BIS, provide new methods for security settlements, combining all individual steps into one transaction and enable tokenized deposits with built-in regulatory checks for wholesale CBDCs. And don't get me started on that. Such a system could also reduce the cost of trade finance for smaller companies. The unified ledger proposed by the BAS may exceed in scope a similar combined platform envisioned by the IMF for CBDCs. This was just breaking news. I just did it like 10 minutes ago. Tobias Adrian, director of the IMF, said in a speech on Monday that a global CBDC platform could be more efficient and safer than traditional platforms. We are at the cusp of another major leap in the monetary and financial system, which will have far-reaching consequences for the economy and society at large. This would be a game changer in how we think about money and how transactions take place. A unified ledger for cross-border payments would also require a significant policy harmonization across jurisdictions. Although central bankers and economists at the BIS are not set on the technological design and aspects of such a unified ledger, they said the institution is not thinking of using a permissionless blockchain. It's got to be permissioned. We got some in mind. Though the mechanism used for affecting the transaction can be decentralized, I think the actual choice of technology will really have to be decided for that particular use case. It could be decentralized, like in a permission blockchain, but it doesn't have to be. It could be a centralized system as well where there is rigorous set of controls on data confidentiality. The next step would be for a group of central banks to come together to take the project forward under a public policy mandate with the help of the private sector, which would handle most of the customer facing activities. And to wrap it up, I think it's going to be a very important coming together of both the official sector as well as the private sector. And rest assured, this is going to be something that we will be discussing going forward. Absolutely huge news. If you pair this up with the article I just shared earlier today, I'll show you it right now for context. This one today, IMF advisor sees power in global ledger that works with CBDCs. And as we go down here, it literally says, under the vision, the cross-border platform would facilitate multi-currency transactions without introducing a new settlement asset, but cryptocurrencies such as XRP have been pitched as such a middleware cryptocurrency, a bridge currency, a common global neutral digital settlement asset to bridge all these central bank digital currencies across the world together. Absolutely unreal news. Can't believe it. Unified Ledger BIS, global CBDC platform from the IMF. What a time to be alive. So for XRP older, follow, like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know how you're feeling about this news.